appointed to the U.S. Senate in December 2019 after Johnny Isaacson resigned, Republican Kelly Loeffler was raised on her family's farm in Stanford, Illinois. The family farm continues to operate with the help of government subsidies common to many farmers. However, Loeffler's public policy position on the much-needed stimulus funds for workers idled by the pandemic contradict this. She's insisted Congress reduce the $600 payments to unemployed workers so they can, quote, get back to work and limit government dependency. In January 2020, Leffler sold stock that was vulnerable to the emerging pandemic. That sale began the same day she attended a private briefing by a Senate committee on the spread of the disease before the public had been alerted to its severity. Leffler denied any wrongdoing, saying the trades of one and a half to three million dollars worth of stock were made by a third-party advisor. Later, she sold the stock in an effort to, quote, move beyond the distraction, and the Department of Justice closed its inquiry into Leffler. That's your minute to win it in the U.S. Senate election for Georgia. Vote on or before January 5th.